then. how they met Slim, with his backside in the sand and beat half hollow. Vault Hunter decided to lend a hand, seeing as they were already in the neighborhood. I think I busted my dang coccyx. Oh, I think I spotted a quarter down here. Good luck, finally turning them. Wait, no, just mighty obliged. Those fellas are as loose as a noose and twice as twisted. They took my money and tossed me on my behind. I'd avenge myself, but my shooting hand's about as steady as a snake with two rattles. You've already got a gun? That's great! I'll teach ya. You got bullets too, right? My brothers pulled that one on me when they first taught me dueling. Heck, I'll do it if it means I can settle my score with Drunk William. And I know just the place to practice. Follow me! Slim's daddy, Lightning Luke, was something of a local legend. When Slim was born, he was a spitting image. Now he's all grown, except for the spine. Most everybody was tickled they could kick Luke's boy around. But if anyone's got dueling in the blood, it's Slim. Sometimes I sneak back here to enjoy my drinks in solitude and safety. There are some bottles lying about. Maybe you can show me some of that sharpshooting of yours? Just give those bottles the old woofer. Go on. To be honest with ya, I'm not really sure myself. I just go with what feels right, you know? Whoa, what a thrill! I'm feeling fresher than a two mint julep. How'd I do? Listen, I'm gonna come right out and say it, and I'm gonna be brutally, savagely honest because I care about you. And it's the only way you'll learn. Your shooting could use some work. But you did your best and you had fun, and that's what matters. Wow, that's the nicest thing anyone's ever said to me. But what if Drunk William shoots me? Wish I had some armor. Slim wasn't about to cross irons with Drunk William with nothing but stitches and sand to keep him standing. Vault Hunter knew they'd have to find some protection for him if they wanted him to grow the stones for a duel. Safety first. Might not stop a bullet, but it might make a man think twice before shooting. Perfect! I'm gonna go get ready for the duel before I forget all the training! Boy, if my pop could see me now, my first duel! My fingers are all in fits, I tell ya! Ain't no turning back now. I'll wait here while you go tell that no good, low down, lousy, lack wit drunk William that I'm a calling him out to do. Drunk William liked to think he was the toughest mother's son this side of the sand. The type of fella who'd chew the fleas off a skag and ask for seconds. But someone <coughs> needed to put him in his place. Which is. You should have seen the look on. Oi! William! You drunken git! My boy Slim is waiting outside to duel ya. If I were you, I'd change into me brown britches. What? Slim wants to duel me? Ha! <laughs> All right, I can use a laugh. You tell him I'll be right out. Drunk William was ready for a fight. Nothing for the vault hunter to do but tell Slim to get ready. Ready as he could get anyhow.
He's coming. Whatever happens, I want you to know I'm proud of you. You're basically my son at this point. And I can't watch you die. You hear me? Don't you worry about me. I've never felt better in all my years. I was born for this. I'm headed for glory. Wait, my head. My head's better than old Pete's domicile. Quick, give me something for my skull cap. Good enough. Toss it up there on the old thinkerator. Golly! My brains are locked up tighter than Granny's pearls. Now I've really got a leg up on drunk William. Wait, my legs, quick! Enough blathering, Slam! Let's get to blasting! Bounty Hunter, you ring that bell over there so I know when I can finally kill this sloppy SOP. We drive the sound of the bell! Fine by me. May as well hang up your holster already, drunk William. While you were drinking with your friends, I studied the way of the iron. You'd be better... Well, don't that beat all. Slim survived, but only just. And they only found his feet with the Vault Hunter's help. Ah, come on then. Ooh, that kicks like a three hail hot dam! But I'm alive! I feel like there's lightning in my veins and thunder in my throat! Next time someone's fool enough to take me on, I'm gonna write my name in their blood. Ain't nobody gonna call me the son of Lightning Luke no more. Y'all can call me Slam Thunder. My boy! My badass boy! I am so glad you survived. I mean, I never doubted you. Except for most of the time I've known you. Ooh, there's a new killer in town. Y'all better believe it. Huh. He survived? Well, come on back, Bounty Hunter, so you can get your coin and I can get to work building boxes. <laughs> well, I don't know if Doolin's gonna catch on like it used to. But the more folks killing each other, the better my business booms. Besides, if this town's gonna survive, we need the roughest roughnecks to know their way around the irons. It's just survival of the fittest, that's all. Till next time, bounty hunter.
Walking out of here alive, you greedy sow. I know you done stole them beans. I ain't never stole no beans in my whole damn life. You here I was, thinking this fib and fester cock was my best friend. Then I go and take a gander at the back of my eyelids for a spell, and she ups and steals all the damn beans. Probably cause she wants to bake them like a savage. Don't you give a chillin' of wit to this no good cheap shot and chiseler. I ain't eating no damn refried beans, so she done stole them and trying to pin the deed on me. Oh, beans are just lovely. I get it, girls. But before there's any bloodshed, let me have a bit of a look around. Fine. Mighty fine. Exceptionally fine. Fine times infinity. Damn. Shame to see friends at each other's throats like that. But I suppose some things are worth fighting for. Maybe even dying for. Lucky what we got here then. 